This is Judge Patty Mayo. Both parties have agreed to abide by the judgment handed down today. The winner will be paid by Patty, and the loser will be subject to the resources of the court to collect their debt. Court is now in session. A weekend getaway turns into a staycation nightmare as Princess Delgado sues Priyanka Pujari for $1,000, claiming the babysitter bailed on her commitment. Priyanka fires back, countersuing for $1,000, alleging Princess is trashing her good name and business. The reason she didn't show up is because she had a bad case of diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> and, you, and you claimed you refunded her the $400. But it does say Priyanka. There are many Priyankas. But you understand that people do get sick. Well, don't be two minutes before you're supposed to come see my kid. This is so embarrassing that we all get to talk about my health issues. And you're talking about your issues. Everyone has to sh It's okay. But I did pay. Does someone get two minutes before they um, have to come in at 2 p.m.? It's possible. Absolutely not. Delgado versus Pujari. Okay, Miss Delgado is suing Miss Pujari for not showing up to babysit her two-year-old daughter. Princess paid $400 in advance as she was leaving for the entire weekend and this young lady came highly recommended but never showed up. So she wants $1,000 as she booked a hotel and a car that was already paid for and had to cancel her trip. She returned the money for the babysitting and the reason she didn't show up is because she had a bad case of diarrhea and a fever due to the food poisoning. Um, Say so she's not in the best business. All right, in the past, Okay, so you guys are each suing each other for $1,000. You want $1,000 because you, you wanted her to watch your baby. She didn't watch your baby, so you had to cancel your trip. You had to cancel the babysitting appointment because you had the runs and the Pujaris. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and, you, and you claimed you refunded her the $400. Did she refund you the $400? No. Okay, do you have proof that you refunded her the $400? I do. Can I see it? I paid in cash. I. Um, I zelled her, and I did not receive. I hadn't seen her. Do you have the pay the payment of Zell? Yes. Can I see that? You saying you never received a Zell payment from her? No. That's how you spell her name. It's kind of hard. How do you uh, Priyanka? Priyanka. Priyanka. Yes. How do you pronounce your last name? Pujari. Oh, I got it right. Okay. There's a four hundred dollars Zell payment to Priyanka. There's no last name. But it does say Priyanka. There are many Priyankas. There are many Priyankas. I barely know anyone else whose name start with a Priyanka. Yeah, I barely also know many Priyankas. Uh, I know uh, I know one right now. Me too. Wait, wait, wait. Where is the name from? India? Yes. How many people live in India? What's that? How many people live, live in, India. in India? I don't live in India. So I think this is a pretty cut and simple case. Oh, no. That's not all. But that's only what I'm asking for. I had to pay for my hotel and my flight. Um, I was on a trip to Curacao and... She called me the morning of, so it's like ridiculous. Did you did you get an, um, travel insurance? No, I don't have travel insurance to go to Curacao. That's a that's a three hour flight. Did you have a contract with her? Did you have a backup? No, no backup okay, because she's supposed to be that. the best. She's reliable. Supposedly she's reliable. But you understand that people do get sick. Well, don't be. Two minutes before you're supposed to come see my kid. Uh, have you ever gotten the shits? Actually, comes on quick. So, huh? med student here. So yeah, I do know about the. Shit. But so you understand that someone get the shits, you want someone who has the shits watching your kid? Does someone get the shits two minutes before they um have to come in at two p.m.? It's possible, but she obviously didn't refund you the money. More like no. bullshit. So. So she's not completely credible. Yeah. Well, or did she did say she refunded? Or dependable or reliable. And unfortunately, I, I although I feel bad for the plaintiff, this is called force majeure. All right, this is an act of God. She couldn't complete performance of the contract because she had she had she had a medical condition and you're Can't. definitely not going to want your child to be around somebody who might be spreading a communicable disease well then you don't need to be watching kids your honor with all the respect can i talk can i get to talk yeah yeah this is so embarrassing that we all get to talk about my health issues but i did refund her the amount and but it was in the cash i didn't have any amount in my account so i had to pay her through the cash because but you still have no receipt for that so that receipts that's so that's what we're coming down to here. I don't have a I don't have a problem not giving her and not awarding her anything for the vacation that she had to cancel. Uh, but for the four hundred dollars, you have to she has to show that she paid the, her back. And you're talking about your issues. Everyone has to share. It's okay. Yeah, but if she has diarrhea, and you're in the medical field, yeah, that's terrible. Come on, judge. You don't want that around your children. It literally could have been bullshit. We don't know if it was. We don't know, but it doesn't matter. Um, you didn't have a backup for it. It's 
like you said, a force of God. She could have just not been feeling well. It doesn't matter the flow that was coming out of her. Okay? The flow rate is not a consideration. Uh, what we are considering um, is that she does owe you $400. Uh, she cannot prove, she cannot prove um, that she paid that back. Um, so I am going to issue that she pay you... <laughs> Is your first name Princess? Yes. Oh, really? Yeah. Like your born name? Yes. That's cool. Um, I am going to award you $400 that she uh, that she owes you, and then we'll take hers as debt um, on Priyanka Pujari. Um, I'm going to give you... How far did you come today? Two hours journey. Do you have a recommendation, Aaron? Judge, I, I would keep it low. Again, she... This isn't her fault. I mean, she's indicated that she... Paid I'm giving her... This is for her credit. This is her benefit. Her credit for time and... Well, she still has my $400. 400 You're getting paid that from this court. Gotcha. So she owes the court 400 but we're going to give but we're gonna give Just her... Just a small amount of the $3,000 that I had to spend for the trip that, you know, is missing in the air as well. That's that's why you buy insurance, Judge. That's why you buy insurance, ma'am. Judge, I'd say $400 for the credit. Absolutely not. I'll issue a $250 credit towards Ms. Pujari for her time, for consideration of time today, which I believe I can do. Yep. No, it says I can't. Okay, Ms. Delgado, you're the winner in this case. We're gonna issue $400. Ms. Pujari, um, you're issued to pay that $400 to the court. Uh, we are gonna give you a $200 credit today, so you owe $200 to the court, which the court will take as debt and you can make payments on. Any questions, comments, concerns? None. Matter is adjourned. How did you feel about the judge's ruling today? Um, slight disappointed because it could have been more. I did spend like $3,000 on my trip and, you know, didn't have that to get in return. But the $400 is okay. It's all that she did owe me, so I'm fine with that. What do you think about the judge case in your, in your ruling today? I wasn't that satisfied though, because it was my fault that I didn't have any kind of receipt or something, but it was fine.